What's going on guys? Welcome back to another vlog. Today I want to share with you the question that's been asked so many times about the UVB light. First of all, am I still using it? And second of all, is it actually helping? I want to address one thing at a time here. If you've been following my channel for a while, you already know that my psoriasis is fully cleared up. I don't have it on any part of my body. That's not because specifically of the UVB light. It's not because of specifically a diet. It's not because just an exercise. It's pretty much all of the above, but also for those of you that keep calling me out on this for whatever reason, yes, I am on the biologic injections. I'm making this video to apologize. For those of you that have been following, I've admitted it multiple times. I'm not hiding the fact. So I have done the Skyreezy injections. They did help, everything went away. And I'm happy because it was just a money thing that will solve the problem. It's not something that will harm me necessarily. Yes, it does have side effects. It will suppress certain immune system. It will make certain things a little bit worse, technically speaking, but I feel great. I feel fine and my skin is clear and I am able to focus on everything else. So now back to the main topic, the UVB light. I have been using it in the past a lot. And what I mean by that is, first of all, the way I was introduced to it was going to the dermatologist's office, standing in a booth. And at first I'll have to drive there, spend my time, get the appointment and so on. And then stand in the booth for about a minute. And then every time it will increase a little bit. So at some point I was there for five minutes and you'll get a nice tan overall in your whole body. And then I'll dress back up, pack my stuff, go home. And essentially that will be anywhere from an hour to two hours of my day every single time. And that was really inconvenient. I researched a way, how can I get this at home? And I found the UVB light, which was a little device, which essentially you shine anywhere you want, anywhere you have the spots, and pretty much you'll do the same thing. So I did that and it was great. I mean, I had a lot of spots in my elbows before, as you've probably seen in past videos, and I'll just shine the light on that spot. And over time, I could see definitely an improvement. It went from like, really flaky to slightly smoother skin to slightly red skin and eventually it will slowly fade. And at one point, the, the spots that I was really focused on will go away. Now, the hardest part about the UVB light, the portable device is being consistent with it. You can use it over and over every single day and then one week you'll be lazy and you put it away and forget about it. And at least that's what happened in my case. I would have it plugged in and I'll use it, but sometimes life catches, uh, catches up with me and I just didn't get to it enough. And next thing you know, it, it's been a week and I was like, ah, whatever, I don't want to use it. And next thing you know, I don't use it at all. And it just kind of collects dust. So that's just a mistake that I made not following that. If you are better disciplined like that, at using it every single day and you guarantee yourself like, no way I'm going to use it, it will help. Now, keep in mind, that this is a band-aid on a broken leg. This is not actually going to heal your psoriasis. It's going to cosmetically make it go away. It doesn't mean it won't come back. Just like with the injections that I took and the UVB leg that I did and the, and the diets that I do, it doesn't mean that psoriasis will never come back. And speaking of that, I, I'm not gonna go on injections potentially any longer. We'll see how it goes. Uh, I'll, I have about a month to decide for the next injection if I'm gonna do it or not. Most likely not. And I'm sticking on the carnivore diet as you saw from the last video. So for now, I'm sticking to the routine. I exercise lots, I sleep uh, well. I make sure the poop type is good. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, look at the last video. I make sure that my energy is there. I make sure that I get all the vitamins I need if I don't get the right things, a supplement. And for now, everything is great. I haven't seen any spikes or any flare ups. So that means that I am good and clear to you from using any UVB light or any medication or any creams. Matter of fact, I haven't used any of those in a very long time, which is amazing. So back to the main question, do I use it? Like I said, not as often. Do I use creams? Not anymore. Uh, if you have a flare up and you have the means to get a UVB light, I definitely recommend you do. It's great to have in your house, especially if your skin does all clear up one day, but then you have that one spot show up. You can use the UVB light on that one spot until it goes away put some cream on it every time you finish using it and then put that device away and then until the next time, right? So at least you have that available, like literally at your at your disposal anytime you want. And that's a great feeling to know that you don't have to call a dermatologist again, don't have to waste your time again. So I hope that little tip helped. Uh, make sure that you leave a like on this video because it is something that's been asked over and over again. I hope I answered all, that all those questions. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and I'll see you in the next vlog.